the Namibia National Olympic Committee and the Namibia Commonwealth Games Association President Abner Hwahup said now that the charges have been dropped in Brazil. Jonas Juniors Jonas will focus on representing the country at the 2020 Tokyo Summer Olympics. Jonas wasn't at the press conference at the time the announcement was made. The judges clearly and anonymously also rejected the complainant's evidence of any untoward or sexual motivated conduct <coughs> on the part of Jonas. So there was no cause, because there was allegation that he tried to kind of rape her, grab her and all those things. So that basically was also not accepted by the appeal court. The judges finally applied the status uh, statutes of limitation of the state punitive code and held any uh, punishability had lapsed, upheld the, de- up, upheld the decision of the court of dos, dos, eh, dos grandes eventos and dismissed the appeal. In short, colleagues, the results of the judgment by the appeal court is that Jonas was acquitted on the rape charge. The conviction of the Miss Mania in the court below became time bared in terms of the status of limitation and no conviction remains in force. Paralympic representative Michael Hamukwaya said that due to the lack of support from the Namibian government, they have lost a sports code for the para athletes. Important sport code that we had, as you remember, in 2016, we had three sport codes because we are just growing. That was athletic, uh, powerlifting, and swimming. Then now, within 20, I mean, for 2020, we are just focusing basically in two sport codes: that is swimming and athletic. But the number also have gone down. It's not the same as it used to be. As you, the media <coughs> have heard also, our main uh, in athletic, our main qualifier was in the, the world championship that was last year. Uh, where we had really a lot of challenges to get to the World Championship. We couldn't even, you know, prepare the team, but at least we thank our sponsor, Nampawa, who came aboard. A Namibia Sports Commission representative was cornered into confessing at the press conference that the government only informs them that there is no money for sports. Yeah, you, you are correctly right. It's not a dialogue. You are correctly right. right. Um, we all know what is happening. It's not a, it's not a secret. We are, we, on a daily basis, we are advocating that we are telling the government this is the document that we are operating under, these are the conditions, this is what you are supposed to do, but you are told there is no money. So, um, you, are, you are right. You are really right. Okay, good. Abner Ahub also added that their team is aware of the coronavirus outbreak and will take measures to ensure that they do not contract the virus while in Tokyo for the Olympics in July.